Today is a dark day in history. My student, my chess student, uh, this young kid from the Netherlands, has abandoned me today. Yes, we had a plan to have a lesson, but uh, it turns out that something more important came up. So, good news is you guys get the free lesson now instead. Woo! <laughs> Give me a break, guys. This is this is um this is not the kind of life you envision for yourself. Let's be honest. Watching some has been making videos on the internet, sharing his age-old lessons with the younger crop, lessons which nobody ultimately cares about. Let's be frank. We got a castle. A lot of pressure building up here. Actually, a little bit too much pressure, I think. I'll have to take it back with the bishop because if I take it, uh, if I take it with the knight instead, he'll have this uh, discovered check attack on my queen. So it's a very, very, very delicate position, and uh, he's playing quite enterprising chess. Quite enterprising chess. I think one of the key ideas might be to to remove this pawn from the equation. A lot of pressure brewing up here. I think I can still manage this situation because uh, the screen is heavily defended. So. That's not the problem. Now where do we drop the knight out? Maybe we should think about this. A lot of different options. How do you just dis decide between them? Well, from here, there's no much further scope. From here, there could be some possibilities there. And from here, there's an immediate pressure on the queen asking him, what if he just steps back? Then you can trade it off. I think let's go with something a bit more immediate. It's a hostile position and it actually does have the check on me. He does have the check on me. So, well, now he has to respond to that. And he responds in a pretty good manner, I guess. Okay, but he can't just take it. He can't just take it. So, let's put some deep tactic tricks up our sleeve as well and and even a potential queen swap tactic here um yeah he's got to respond to this first so so let's see okay so he obviously had to respond. Now comes the big question. Do we drop the, the knight in there already? Are we worried about queen mating patterns? No, I'm not. Should we deflect the queen away first? It offers him some check possibilities. But I kind of like it. That's what I'm initially leaning towards is this kind of hostility here directly pressuring in the most because we've got a triple attack here we have to keep that in mind and wow well quick resignation there why did he resign well because bishop check forces the king here and then it's made right after so cool very interesting game